Hi, welcome to Hard Rest Info. In front of me is just Manana, and now I'm going to show you how to perform first setup of this device. So at the very beginning, uh, you should know that here we have the camera, right? And here we have the display with the battery. Okay, so at the very beginning, we should uh, install the lenses because there is a bad idea to use it without lenses because protective lens is a very very important part of our camera just to have it always in good condition right okay uh, so here we have uh, our screen with battery so sh what should we know uh, what should we do we should press on this and these buttons together as you can see in this way and just install the camera you can install it in this way or in this way okay then release buttons and make sure it's installed in place okay now just uh, press and hold one of these buttons you can press and hold a button on the um, screen or wait while you can press and hold the button on the camera wait now it's not works. Okay. So, what should we do now? Uh, of course, uh, choose the language. This is the uh, first thing we should do. And then we should connect it to the mobile application. But what should we do first? Right, install the application. So, to install the app, you should just open App Store on your device for example like in my case uh, or Play Store or Play Market if you have Android and find here Insta360 oh so sorry not the Insta but DJI application okay o open DJI Mimo app Click download and wait a while. Cool. Now click open and uh, allow, agree with everything. You can join the pro project, you can discard it. And now uh, click the button. So sorry, click. Oh my gosh, and as you can see it's automatically detected my uh, Osmo Nano, right? But you can click on this button and if it will not detect, uh, well it's not detect, uh, detected uh, your Osmo Nano, it will open the camera and you will be able to, to scan the code. In my case it's just see it uh, using the Bluetooth. So click connect. Uh, confirm that you see the same password, click accept, agree, allow access, and then you should log in uh, your uh, login in your account. So in my case, I will uh, log in using my credentials, you should log in using yours. So I will pause the video to login. Okay, in my case, I login succeed. Uh, then click activate. Click activate and wait a while. As you can see, as you can see, it works. And it asks about DJI Care refresh. I don't want to activate uh, paid features. I'm paid for the camera. Uh, go to okay don't want to go to question area get started cool enjoy live view uh, manage files with efficiency advanced skills okay click next 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 and now it will automatically update your device so it's very important to to wait for it so uh, now uh, during the downloading so click start and uh, just uh, see the hints how to use your new camera click ok done 
and cool cool now it works now you can check out how it works uh, you can check out that it works uh, without connection to the uh, to the screen right so uh, you can charge your camera uh, using this mini maybe power bank with the screen right but you can uh, use it without it you can have here preview and record something using just the camera it's really 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 fine thing so now just let's wait a while uh, for downloading firmware and I will uh, I will back after downloading okay after a while uh, it will ask you about installing the firmware so click install click connect device connection click connect yeah we want to connect it and it's better to okay join and it's better to uh, connect your camera to your screen uh, during update so wait a while join yeah sometimes we can have problems with iPhones uh, because sometimes iPhone uh, don't want to connect to the network without the internet so sometimes we should do it manually uh, so how to do that open settings open Wi-Fi and here connect to the Osmo Nano and disable auto connection to other Wi-Fi networks in this way it will work wait a while And as you can see, in my case, uh, I can't update my device just because uh, it 10% uh, battery remains, but it needs more than 15% battery, both on your screen, so on your uh, receiver, and on your camera too. So I have 10% on, on the camera, so I should charge it uh, before going. But how to charge it? So firstly we should disable the uh, camera and the transmitter, uh, so and the receiver, and then and then we should open the cover on the receiver, as you can see, and just charge it using the uh, USB-C cable previously installed the camera. As you can see, so wait a while, I will uh, charge my device uh, and we will continue okay here we go after several minutes it charged up to 90% uh, of this block and this block 93% okay so now let's enable it wake up wake up connect join of course and now click new firmware available install and just wait for two minutes okay that's it click down update in progress wait a while connect and now as you can see updated so that's it guys hope this video was helpful for you now you know how to charge your camera how to connect your camera to the uh, receiver how to connect it to your mobile application here you can find your album you can use your camera uh, your, your application to preview uh, everything from the camera mm. You can even take photos or videos using just uh, application on your device. Okay, and and cool, that's it. So guys, hope this video was helpful for you. If it's true, please consider to leave a like and a comment below. See you.